Requiem of the Rose King, episode 22. Battle lines have been drawn all because of well, sa opening scene kasi Kent already uh, the Duke of Kent already started his own revolt. Pero without without consulting the Duke of Buckingham first, Buckingham now has no choice but to to set his plan into motion right away. That is to to march to London and of course unseat Richard the Third. The very same, uh, the very same king he placed there. So, ano response to Richard? Of course, he is the king. Send, uh, send to the forest of Dean his his finest troops. Yung talagang yung talagang nakasama niya sa sa pagigibaglaban ng araw sa gera. It was only a matter of time before the battle of Dean uh, commenced. So, patay mo matika buo na naman tayo. Although yeah, although it, it it wasn't it wasn't shown in the episode, cause hey, well, they there there may be kids watching. In one moment, nagkita sila Richard at Buckingham, so nagabulan. Then oh, sword fight ensues. Pero um, despite Richard's Richard's battle experience, na nagapisan niya nuri don, nagapisan ni Buckingham. Of course, siya sabi ni Buckingham na it's it's not too late, Richard. Let's get away from here. Richard gave Buckingham a um, the much needed reality check, so to speak. Kasi, sinabi na ni Richard dito na, Buckingham, you opened my eyes to the truth. This is now my light. I am the king now. Well, her point was this. Abay, kung tatry to lang mo ako ng ganito, ay, magsulian na tayo ng kandila. As a farewell token, she takes off one of her rings Binigay kay Buckingham. One that has the royal seal. So, bininin na niya kay Buckingham na that wherever he goes, just show that ring. It'll it'll get you out of a tight spot. Later on, he voluntarily surrenders. Much to the surprise of Richard Catesby, even, uh, even Queen Anne. So, talagang... Medyo na distraught si Richard dito kasi hindi naman yun na pinag-usapan na ni Buckingham in the first place. So as one final request of a um uh, of a um of a convict that's about to get You get you get what you get what I'm saying guys, right? Buckingham requests uh the king's presence. Pinarili niya kay ano, pinarili niya kay Kate's B. Well, obviously hindi siya pinagbigyan. So, final scene on the day of his execution. Ang ang nakakagulat dito was who the executioner was. It was Richard herself. Pero naka nakahud, okay? Ta talaga di siya magi magikilala. Pero Buckingham took a good look at her face. Yon know, sinabi Richard's parting words were like this. Bottom line. I'll see you in hell, Henry. Suck! Bigo, mga lifestyle. Ay, Ferrari. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, okay? I really want to get back at those, uh, those, uh, those really dense people who, um, who have been, who have been flaming this anime recently for, um, for being trash. Hello? All right. Through this, we're gonna dispel them all. We're gonna break that episode down now. Critics up style. Base. Typical Requiem of the Rose King pacing. Alright. Tons of explainer sequences which um which the normies don't understand. And for an anime as complicated as this one, Abba. You really need to um to make the pacing at least at least tense. Whether it be fast or slow, but not not too fast, cause there's uh there's a lot to be absorbed in one episode of this anime. Okay? Tama lang yung pacing ng episode na to. Because, syempre, nagpapataya na naman eh. Ano naman bagala mo pacing dito? Eh, nagbabakbaka na nga eh. Okay? Nag-uubusan na lang, nag-uubusan na nga ng tao eh. And, the final scene, yeah, it's, it is an execution scene. The, the, there was that tense pacing. So, do I have complaints, Bigo, mga ka-lifestyle? No! I don't know 
why why some uh why some fans are flaming this anime oh ganda naman ang pacing ha alam nyo kung bibilisan nyo ang pacing you need to you need to put in as many explainer sequences as possible para hindi mawala ang viewers sa episode I don't know why these normies are taking offense at the um at the slideshow pacing uh, the slideshow presentation hello have you are you fresh out of school or something <laughs> so for me I'm totally satisfied about the pacing of this episode flow naman well I only saw two gear shifts here to tell you frankly alright uh, to tell you frankly every scene in this episode is a gear shift but for critiquing sake I'll cite only two first one was the time nung nagkita si, sila uh, nagkita sila Richard at si Buckingham during the Battle of Dean I don't know why why um yeah this anime has its yaoi has its yaoi feels pero you don't see the bottom line if you see this as a yaoi anime through this gear shift you can you can disclaim yourself for that kasi alalaan ninyo Richard is a hermaphrodite alright it doesn't matter anymore if he was raised as a boy or a girl Bali wala na gender preferences dito. It has been confirmed two episodes ago na hermaphrodite nga si Richard III. You can't go to sa yaoi anime anymore. And through this gear shift, yeah, you can totally um you can totally discredit yourself for calling it a yaoi. Final gear shift was when Ayun nga, that scene we're in. Ayun, nagpa-arresto na si Buckingham. He voluntarily surrendered. Call me an idiot if I don't call this a gear shift. Yung pagkakasuko ni <clears throat> ni Buckingham. Again, this, oh, not again. This gear shift will also tell you that, oh, Buckingham may have, may have Lancastrian roots at ininggan niya na sila ni, ni Lord Stanley na oh, to uphold his Lancastrian roots. And uh, revolt uh, and start a revolt against the king. But, na, na, nanaig dito yung kanyang pagiging, well, pagiging loyal sa corona ng Inglaterra. Not, 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 to, not to Richard herself. Okay? Not to Richard herself. But to the crown of England. These two gear shifts that I saw, definitely, We'll have repercussions in the final two episodes. What? Um. And again, I don't know why, uh, why other people are calling this anime trash. It's beautifully done. It has a lot of, like I said a while ago, bigo, mga lifestyle. For an anime as complicated as. This one, or even Tomodachi game, right? You know how complicated that anime is. You need explainer sequences to make the viewer understand what is what what is actually going on in the episode. Now, if the viewer is dumb as fuck, hey, it's not the animation studio's fault anymore. That's not my opinion, guys. That's a fact. Therefore, Malinis ang plot, Bigo. Mga ka-lifestyle. It's a totally clean plot. Okay? Kung hindi nila nilagyan ng mga explainer sequences dito, wala. Sira ang episode na to. Alright? Uh, these normies claims will be justified. Pero, you 
There's enough explainer sequences in this episode to make you understand what the episode was all about. So, it's still a clean plot. I couldn't say it's a well-ironed-out plot because only a plot will be ironed, will be well ironed out kung meron siyang backstory or side story. Ito, explainer scenes lang eh. To further enhance the understanding of the viewer. Malinis pa rin ang plot, guys. Alright? Take my word for it. So, pace, flow, and plot simply came together for this episode, folks. So, Requiem of the Rose King, episode 22? Ito po 23. Sorry. Two thumbs up. So, we're going to, um, we're going to have to deal with the new schedule. Okay. Well, there's a reason why I, I did not include episode 21 in this review. Kasi, um, we can actually forego episode 21. This is a, this episode is more crucial than that, eh. And dito yung battle of Dine. Dito nagkasagupa ang dalawang dating ang dalawang dating magkaibigan eh. Okay? I'm, I'm talking about historical fact now, guys. Okay? D dalawang mag magkaibigan nito eh. Si Richard III at ang Duke of Buckingham. I think, uh, according to historical accounts, magkababata ang dalawang to. So, yeah. Um, they were born into an era of violence political intrigue and even yeah um, under the table deals regarding the crown I say Wars of the Roses yun eh. so can't wait for the final two episodes guys I don't know about these normies who are who are, uh, who are totally discounting this anime as trash you don't know a good fucking anime when you see one sus Ako. Let's just mentally prepare ourselves for the final two episodes. I'm uh, I'm totally bracing myself for for more deep dives into this anime because it has been doing that for for 22 straight episodes now. So it has no reason to stop. Okay. So again, Requiem of the Rose King episode 22, two thumbs up. Another two thumbs up for Requiem of the Rose King, Maka Lifestyle. Oh, wow. Buckingham had his head roll, literally. So, Bigo, wait for my next upload regarding this anime. And if you're still stuck with the CHT, gumulo na ulo ni Buckingham, nandiyan pa rin kayo? Ano ba yan? Napugutan na masa ng ulo? Ay, nako. I'll just get my... I'll just get my popcorn again and watch you chill. Enjoy this review, and I'll see you in the next one.